Hello, everyone. Thanks for logging on to CBSColorado.com. A few more minutes here with Broncos linebacker Josie Jewell. Josie, you guys fresh off the bye week. You go into the bye with a win. Everyone kind of in the locker room after the game was saying how huge that is. So what's the mood? What was the mood at the practice today? I mean, do you guys feel refreshed, a little weight off your shoulders maybe after getting that win? Yeah, for sure. It was a great momentum booster for us. Uh, you know, we need that win. We had a couple losses in a row there. Um, and then, you know, a win going into the bye week kept that good energy going. Everybody wants to keep on working uh, hard. Um, and, you know, this yesterday or today was a great day. Uh, just, you know, another uh, foundation step, um, you know, stepping forward and getting their uh, Titan stuff in and, you know, just getting a little bit of head start on them. And uh, everybody's feeling great. You know, one thing I love about this defense is that whenever we ask you guys about your performance, you're always like, no, it's not good enough, even though you guys are just balling out every single week. What is the mentality of this defense as you look at these next nine games? Uh, yeah, always can be better. Uh, we're still looking for our best game, uh, and every week we are. Um, and, you know, November and December is when you want to play your, some of your best football. So uh, we're striving for that, and uh, we'll see what happens. But definitely, uh, you know, want to get better every, every week, every month here, um, and hopefully end it on a high note. When you look at the other side of the ball, obviously they had a lot of struggles earlier in the year. But even you look at that Jacksonville game, look like, oh, man, these guys really started to figure it out. Curious from the defensive side, what did you see in that game from the offense? Yeah, a great rhythm. They, you know, they got in a couple of different types of rhythm there. Um, Russ did a great job controlling the game a little bit. Um, and, you know, that's what's to be expected. You know, he's a great quarterback. The offense has a lot of weapons. Um, so, you know, we're just uh, we're excited for what they can do, and I think uh, I think they're going to do great things. You know, you just got to be patient with some things and, you know, a lot of new pieces, a lot of different stuff. So uh, we're all excited. When you look at three and five, I mean, the season really is w wide open down this stretch. What do you think are the keys for you guys to make a run here now in, in the end of the season? Yeah, you know, the rest of November is going to have to be consistency is the biggest one. Uh, being able to finish out, you know, this month with a couple wins um, and then, you know, ride that train into December um, and, you know, hopefully get a playoff berth after that. But uh, definitely just got to stay consistent. You know, we got a good schedule coming up. We got Kansas City twice. Uh, we still got the Raiders here. We got the Chargers again in our conference. Um, and then we got a couple other good teams like the Ravens ahead. So uh, don't look too far ahead. We're going week to week. Um, but when you look at the big picture during the bye week, which I did, um, you know, we got to be able to stay consistent. I think we can have, you know, a good outcome with the second half of the season. You mentioned the Chiefs. How, how much, I know you go week to week, but how much you got that one circled about, all right, yeah. we finally got to get one on those It's always guys. circled preseason very, very early uh, to be like the game where we, you know, we really want to win. Um, you know, because the past couple of years hasn't been good for us uh, versus them. So uh, definitely a big game. Uh, but like we said, uh, you know, taking it day by day, week by week. Uh, when we get to that week, uh, we'll give it our, give it our all. And, but first off, you got Tennessee coming up this week. Josie, thank you so much. We appreciate you and all of your great insight taking the time this evening for Romy Bean. I'm Romy Bean. This is Josie Jewell. Thanks for logging on to CBSColorado.com. We'll see you guys next time.